What's up, Ron here. Today on 3D Nerd Stuff, we're gonna print out Groot. I am Groot. All right, let's get started. Uh, first thing we'll do is we'll switch over to Thingiverse. And in Thingiverse, here we've got Groot. So we'll go ahead and download Groot. And then once Groot's downloaded, we will bring him up in Matter Control. So let's add Groot. There he is. Now there's actually two of them in here. We're going to do the low. And it'll take just a second for it to load all the meshes for Groot. Now we're going to do this one the same way we did Yoda. We're going to do this on medium quality with a 15% infill. With PLA, uh, we're going to go ahead and do support material on a raft. Uh, we're gonna, just going to leave it with basically the same settings we had. We can go ahead and view the layers on this. Alright, and as you can see, we have Groot loaded up now. Uh, we have his layers here. If we wanted to, we could go down through his layers and show him off. As we can see here, it's going to says it's going to take uh, was that seven hours and 35 minutes to print? Um, was it 20,695 millimeters of material, which is 61.72 grams? So he's going to take a little bit of time and a little bit of material, but he'll be well worth it. So there you go, as you can see him. And he's a fairly nice looking model. So we will get. The bed heated up and the extruder heated up, everything all preheated and get him off to print.
here we have Groot. He is printed out. He looks really good. You can see some of the finer details in his back and stuff. On top of his head. There's a little bit of stringing on top of his head, but nothing too severe. Rest of him looks really good. He has all of his support material in his raft to try and get off, get him off of. I know I said I was going to stop printing with rafts, but if this one doesn't come free, then yeah, I'm going to, well, limit my use of rafts till I figure out how to get them to come free. And maybe the secret's not letting it cool down so much. I mean, these are stone cold. They've been sitting around for a day or two before I actually went to pull the draft off of it. So we'll see how that does. We'll get him cleaned up and bring him right back. Okay, as you can see, we've got Groot cleaned up now. Now, as you can see here, there is a little bit under the chin that could use a little sandpaper and a little filing work. I could not get the raft to come through. I even scratched at it with a knife and picked at it. But I'll look into why that's not coming free. But for a desk ornament the way he is, it's really not that important that that comes off of him. Um, as you can see, he's got some really nice detail to him. He looks really good. He printed out fantastic. Still a little bit of clean up here and there. I could use a little bit of like 2000 grit sandpaper to clean him up, make him look real good. But there you go. I am Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot. Thank you all for watching. If you like what you saw, please like and subscribe. Please leave a comment down below. I'd love to hear from you. Until next time, have a great day. What's up? Today on 3D Nerd Stop. <laughs> I know. I am Root. I know. Thank you all for watching. If you like what you saw, please like and subscribe. Please leave a comment down below. I'd love to hear from you. <laughs>